We usually train every day. We love competing. We just want to get out there and fight. I don't think I've seen in my 25 plus years of coaching any, uh, any kids at this age that are this good. When the other person's trying to go this way, we just hit it that way. And that's your secret? Yeah, yes. that's mine. They're very, very good. Um, they have the potential to be amazing. I want to go around the world so different people can see me, how like I play. I see myself on the pro tour. They're not there yet. There's a long row ahead of them. We're seven. Seven years old. We've, We've been, been doing, doing this for five. like five years. Yeah. I introduced boys to tennis when they were very little, I think about six months old. Once they turned, uh, I think, two, we started taking them more, more and more to tennis courts. I've coached eight kids that were number one in the United States, but truthfully, nowhere close to the level of these two. They are so far beyond the normal seven, eight-year-old right now that I can actually teach them on an advanced scale that I would do with like a 12 and a 13-year-old. They're fun to play with. They're like, they're like many professional players. I've never seen anything like it. <laughs> you expect sort of a softer ball to come back, but it's not quite that. They're definitely pretty, pretty impressive. Right now they're very, they're very small. When you take a seven-year-old and a 12-year-old, there's gonna be a big size difference. Never seen a seven-year-old that can run two miles without stopping. <laughs> Miki and Kaylin are one of the most amazing kids that I've ever, ever trained. The discipline in the kids, it, it blows me away. They're two extremely gifted athletes. Boys were real natural fighters from a get-go. Pregnancy was very difficult and we had to fight for their life. They were slightly premature and you know we spent days in hospital. I'm a very involved mother, I'm an educator as well, and I think by loving your children and encouraging them and fostering their self-esteem, you can have very special children. Scale is more spontaneous. Because I want to be famous. On the court, he, is, he has a more of an aggressive game. Mika, he's more of a defensive game. You can see their personality when you see them on the tennis court. I want to be one of those players who are known for what they did great, like Roger Federer. It feels great that you could be in front of a crowd hitting with a professional player and you're the youngest there. We're gonna do it together. We might, we wanna be like the Bryan brothers. They're the best doubles teams. They're twins and one's the lefty, one's the righty. They're brothers, Kim. They're twins. They're, they're brothers and they, and they play best tennis probably in doubles we've ever seen before. I watched the Bryan brothers play in the national events when they were younger. Well, it's actually very incredible to think that these two have the chance to do what they were. Wow, and you really think that? No, I really do. They want to get better, and they don't ever seem to get tired of being out on the court. <laughs>